personally me melda i think that is the bullshit they're saying those days your friends text but me melda i'm saying this today and i'll see you tomorrow <laughs> Oh baby girl, come over. You said excuse me. The love here got to be easy. When it's serious, no cry, no do cool me. The way you stress me, ready go kill me, so baby. I know certain times I used to. Hey, I'm Hotty Gang. What's good? What's bad? What's everything? Everything. You see what I'm saying? It's a girl, Melda, and I'm back at it again today with another banger video. My returnees, baby boobs. How are you guys doing? I miss you guys a lot. You understand? And then my new babies who just clicked on this videos, babies, you are welcome. I'm not going to force you to subscribe. Wait and watch about two minutes or three minutes of this video, and then nobody's going to tell you to subscribe to join the family. You're going to join the hood on your own. So, without further ado, let's get into the video. Okay, guys, I'm not actually well, but I'm trying to create content for you all. So, you guys should just pray for me. I wish me speedy recovery in the comments down below. You can see I'm not well. Yeah, and wish me speedy recovery in the comments down below. Today we are doing something, something nice. Yes, I'm going to teach you all what to do. Okay, so today we are doing ladies code, ladies code. So I have some things written down right here on the sheets of paper, as you all can see, that I'll be looking on to elaborate you guys on. So just stay tuned and then let's go. Let's spend about eight minutes or nine minutes together it's not long just watch the full video please okay okay so the first one i have here is as a lady you should mind your own business that's very necessary as a lady mind your own business don't be peeping through people's affairs don't be sticking your notes into things that nobody has called you about as a lady know how to mind your business just mind your business you understand mind your business is necessary mind your business you understand the second point I have here is um, check up, like check on your sister. As a girl could you check up on your sister. I'm not feeling well, you're a friend. You have to check up on me. I've just, like, not nice. You have to tell me this dressing you put up today is not nice. This video you filmed is not nice. Just criticize me when it's necessary. Like, check up on me. You understand? Yeah. The third point is that support each other. As a lady and as a girl could, like a lady could, a girl could, you need to support your sister. I'm a YouTuber. I have a lot of business pages and other stuff like that. Right now, I also want to contest for my Malika. And you claim you're my sister. You claim you're a girl. You're not supporting me. What? Be supportive, babe. Be very, very supportive. Support me. Support your sister. Support everybody. Do you understand? The moment that you are a lady, like, that makes you a part of this girl could just be supportive be supportive support your sister please support your sister okay so the next one i have here is um don't share your secrets listen i'll put a definition of secrets here that's the definition of secret just read it up seriously secret is meant to be in your head alone not for you to share it to somebody else secret is supposed to be in your head alone i mean it don't go and tell somebody your secret because assuming you're not able to keep your secret on your own how do you expect somebody to be able to keep your secret let your secret secret so please don't share your secrets let your secrets be in your head you went to you went to do this with this boy you went to kill this woman let it be in your head your hand your head can contain it don't share your secrets whatever when you are betrayed you are going to cry don't share your secrets don't share your secrets don't let a guy get between you and your sister. This is very necessary. Don't let a guy get between you and your sister. Don't let a guy get between you and your best friend whatsoever. Okay, we are friends and then we all like the same guy. Why should he be? Why should he be like the same guy? Don't let any guy get between you and your sister. Don't let any guy get between you and your sister. I mean it. Seriously. No matter what, it's like, learn to let the boy go and then be fine with your sister. Be fine with your friend. Don't let any guy under any circumstance get between your sister and you. The next one we have here is, don't hit on another lady for no reason. Seriously. Somebody will come and tell you, this lady said your head is like this. This lady said you are not beautiful. This lady said your buttocks is flat. I don't give a damn. Since you didn't hear it from the person, you can just try and approach the person and ask them, why did they say this about me? Why did they say this about me? Don't be there and draw your own conclusion that this girl, she's a foolish... No, don't hit on her for no reason. Like, ask her. Ask her before you conclude. Do you understand? Ask her. Don't... You understand that thing? Tell your sister if her man is cheating on her. Tell your sister if her man is cheating on her. So you are my best friend, you are my friend, you are my classmate, you are my 
cost me my roommate whatever and then i find out your boyfriend is cheating on you it's my duty as a sister and as part of a girl's school for me to come and tell you although i pet i basically said in the beginning that don't like mind your own business but this one don't mind your business about it spill the tea to her seriously spill the tea to her tell her sister your boyfriend is cheating on you is this is that is that don't keep it to yourself don't keep it to yourself tell her so in case she finds out later when you knew about it you wouldn't be blamed because you'd be like okay at least you wanted that she didn't listen okay tell him the last one of all the points here is that okay they are saying the girl called is saying don't date your friend's ex personally me Melda, i think that is a bullshit seriously why shouldn't i date my friend's ex why what if you are meant to be? What if destiny wants us to be together because they have stopped and because I have this foolish perception that I shouldn't date my friend's ex, I'll let the person go. It's never done anyway. They're saying those days your friend's ex, but me, me older, I'm saying this today and I'll see you tomorrow. You can date your friend's ex. You can date her sister. Feel free. You can date her. It's not anything like it's not anything. But if you want to follow the girls code, you can. I think that's where I get to end today's video. I don't really have much to say. I'm not really feeling well, but I got to film this content for you all. Then you guys can see YouTube took down my previous video because of the thumbnail or whatsoever. So if you don't watch the video, just go and watch it because I think I might delete the video. And nobody told me I look nice, although my hair is kind of grown a little now, but how good one. Okay, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. The new babies who are waiting for two minutes or three minutes to subscribe, I hope you subscribed already. If you aren't convinced yet, I promise to make this this video a very better one next time. So please subscribe and wait for the best. Subscribe and anticipate for the best, you understand? Yes. That's basically it today. Do all the do so you join the family. And still a girl on Melda and then I'm out. Peace out. Bye.